How'd you like our song? It's a little on the dark side, but you know, that's cool. If there's one thing that unifies a fractious country, it's sporting heroes. He's had the weight of his country on his shoulders for how long? Can he get that weight off? So you basically outran your captors. When I left Sudan, I said, I will never, never run again. South Sudan as a region has been at war for over 50 years. My parents, they had to make a choice. Do we want to let the child die in front of us? Or do we want to send it somewhere? When did you last see your family? Was there ever a time where running was a way to escape from the past? Can you tell us when you arrived in America? It was mid-quarter. I just asked him if he ever ran before, and he said, didn't know it was a sport. And he said, are you ready to run? I said, to run where? And then after that, it was just championships, wins, just took off from there. It eventually, it kind of dawned on me, like, he's got deep down stuff. The guys, my teammate, I could laugh with them, but inside me, my heart is always in fire because of the situation back home. The civil war in Sudan has killed more than two million people. The people of Sudan will vote on whether the nation should split into. This is the birth of a new nation. I have to do something. I'm running, I'm running, I'm running, but something in my mind said, Olympic 2012. For Gore, he was running his first marathon. His goal was to qualify for the Olympics. It's going to give me opportunity. It's a ticket. There was this guy who suddenly was turning in good times in marathons and didn't actually have a country that he was running for. Two years after independence, a civil war started. And instead of eliminating one another, we should be using one another to build a country in a peaceful